Can't believe you made it through that separatist shooting gallery, Captain. Your ship isn't even scratched. It takes guts landing in the middle of a battlefield. Nice flying. I owe it all to my lightning reflexes and crackerjack timing. Clearly had a lot of practice getting shot at. My name's Skavik. I'm picking up those blasters in your cargo hold. Excuse the rush, but uh, need to get out of here quick. This village used to be safe, but the Separatists are taking over. If I were you, I'd haul jets as soon as we're done. Who are these people? What are they after? Separatists want to break away from the Republic. <laughs> Judging from all the explosions, they're serious about the idea. Sounds like the bombing's getting closer. The Separatists will be right on top of us any minute. Here's your payment for making this run, Captain. As soon as I have those blasters, you'll be free to fly. Skavik, we've got a big problem. Separatists took over the local air defense cannon. Oh, slow down. Slow down, Corso. What are you talking about? They deployed some kind of remote control stations, hijacked the cannon's targeting computer. Damn Separatists just destroyed an incoming Republic transport. I'm sure the Republic troops will get everything under control. They've already got their hands full. Separatist rocket launchers just attacked a Republic walker, knocked it down hard. With those remote control stations, the Separatists can override the air defense cannon's computer, turn that firepower against us any time they want. That's bad news, Captain. The Separatists will blast you out of the sky even if you think about taking off. The Separatists have remote control stations all over the area. You'll probably have to hit several before they lose control of that cannon. I should charge extra for my thrilling heroics. Good luck. Hope we see you again. Let's move, Corso. We're running out of time. Stand by a tick. HQ, this is forward recon. Do you copy? HQ! Blast. Thought I had him. You look like you know your way around a blaster. Wanna be a hero? What's a hero make these days, hmm? More than me, citizen. That sounds fair, then listen up. A crack separatist militia has taken over this village. So we're not talking dumb grunts and farmers. They've got experts in there with serious jamming equipment. What's the big deal? My mission is to deliver recon on this village, but I can't report anything through this interference. I need those Separatist jammers neutralized. So if you're headed into the village anyway, maybe you can handle it for us. If you waste those Separatist jammers, report back here. I'll see if I can requisition some equipment you could use.
Captain, you there? It's Corso. We got trouble back at the hangar. Is my ship all right? For now, but maybe not much longer. Separatists are busting into the hangar. We're giving them a warm welcome, but we could use a hand. Skavik, get over here. Help me seal this hangar door. Skavik, what are you... Glad you made it back in one piece. Me and my squad owe you one. Thanks to you, we're cutting through the Separatist interference. Be reporting back to base in no time. Here, a little something from our private stock. Watch your hide out there, hero. Like a gundark used my skull as a drum. Thanks for saving my hide, Captain. Skavik helped those Separatists get in here. He stabbed us in the back. That scum stole my ship. He took all the weapons, too. He and the Separatists must have been planning this all along. Hang on. Where's Torchy? I don't believe this. Skavik stole my blaster. Torchy's a genuine blast tech, all 25, with magnetomic adhesion grip and side-mounted rangefinder. She's too good for Skavik. I'm surprised Skavik didn't steal the whole hangar. He's not getting away with this. Come on. Come on, pick up, blast you! Oh, what's the matter, Corso? Did I hurt your feelings? Be thankful you're alive, kid. Bring my ship back, and I'll consider forgiving you. You know, this rest bucket handles like a drunken poo pack, but, uh, I like it. You know the saying, right? Finders keepers? On behalf of Ord Mantel's glorious freedom fighters, I thank you for your blasters, your ship, and a big laugh. Have a nice day. Don't be stupid. You can't win. It's no use. He cut the comm channel. He always was good at making an exit. Skavik stole my best blaster, but I guess it's not as bad as losing a whole starship. I feel for you, Captain. Listen, Skavik and I were working for a guy named Vidu. When he finds out Skavik's a separatist, he'll want revenge just like you. Do yourself a favor and go talk to Vidu in Fort Garnick. I guarantee he'll help get your ship back. Who exactly is this mysterious boss of yours? How can he help? Vidu is the king of cargo. There isn't a payload that comes to Ord Mantell that doesn't pass through him. Vidu's a smart guy with connections everywhere. If anybody can find your ship, it's him. I have to lock down this hangar, but I'll send Vidu a hollow and tell him what's up. Fort Garnick isn't far from here. I'll see you and Vidu there soon, Captain. <laughs> Adu, Private Westner, 31st Recon out of Fort Garnick. Watch your head out there. Separatists deployed snipers in the area last week. Good snipers. Plenty of casualties between here and Fort Garnick. Those seps will shoot at anything. Where are their targets? Soldiers, vehicles, civilians. 
especially the refugees from all the war-torn settlements. They pass through on their way to the refugee camp outside Fort Garnick. Boom. Sniper bait. Most despicable thing I've ever heard. Yes, ma'am. All the way despicable, ma'am. Fort Garnick wants those snipers retired ASAP. Commander Vray even offered a week's pay to anyone who makes it happen. I'll kill this scum for free. It'll be a pleasure to watch, ma'am. If you take out the snipers, report to Commander Vray at the refugee camp outside Fort Garnick. Good hunting. Chai Chai Konkuta Nakma Noya Chuski Nawi Kuchusu Yamata Chutoya Bafok Bachi Wanta Humpa Muli Rabam Pahula I wouldn't mind meeting some like minded individuals to maybe discuss some wholly legitimate business practices. Neon Pipat Malia Petwana Nebopo Chichopa Goma Chitonka Yilishka Changanga Babompa Konkati Im Kanaya Nukan, Kinim Naya Lak Um Nuk Mege. Manalan Yam Perlo, Am Kakalami, Naya Kira Lebua. Karini, Anikak Nikak, Kinia Kak Anakuam Jama. Welcome, Captain. I'm Vidu. Corso told me we've had a rough day. How about a drink to wash away our worries? Here's a toast to my favorite things. The best collection of artworks and exotic beverages in the whole system. And here's to the stupid separatists who destroyed it all. Between them and that backstabber Skavik, I am thoroughly ruined. The blasters Skavik stole in your ship belong to Rogan the Butcher. As employers go, he's not the most forgiving. That's a tough break. I'm sorry. Feel sorry for yourself. I'm working for him, but you're working for me. He'll blame us equally for this mess. He's killed enough people to fill a convoy of bulk freighters, and now we've crossed him. Rogan bought those blasters to protect his business from separatists. When he finds out what's happened, guess who dies first? The only way we're getting out of this alive is finding Skavik, your ship, and those stolen blasters. I've got an idea of where to start looking for Skavik. There's a guy named Reiki, who's an expert on separatists. Problem is, Reiki's stuck behind a Republic blockade. Troops have his village surrounded while they contain the separatists there. 
How did the Separatists manage to take over a whole town? Separatists have sympathizers in every village, helping them hold towns they take over. Traitors. I'm friendly with the Republic commander in charge of the blockade. I can get you in and out of the village. But you'll have to earn that free pass by taking out a few Separatists to prove your loyalty. You up for that? What am I going to prove by shooting Separatists? That you're not one of them. The Republic isn't letting any Separatist sympathizers out of that place. Riki's village is running out of basic supplies thanks to the Republic blockade. Things are getting desperate in there. I'll pull together a survival kit. You smuggle it to Reiki, and he'll tell you a way to find Skavik. Reiki's at a hideout in Talaran Village. I'll send a message so he knows you're coming. Soldier! Soldier! Oh, you're a Civ. Well, still, I can use all the help I can get if you're interested in work. What's in it for me? The Republic's authorized hazard pay to anyone who'll help. We got lots of money, but we're short on personnel. How does that sound? Sounds like you've just found the person for your mission. Glad to hear it. You look like a professional. We need that. One of my boys dozed off on guard duty last night. But the fort's stock of medicine gets stolen. We don't get that medicine back. Them good Republic soldiers are gonna leave Ord Mantell in body bags. Any idea who took the medicine? Sleepyhead claims he woke up as the thief was making her escape. Only saw the back of her, but she looked like a Cathar. The Cathar are aliens. Sort of cat people that live nearby. Some were driven out of their homes from the fighting. The refugee camp is a good place to start. Please hurry. Good soldiers' lives depend on this medicine. I'm sorry, Riso. I don't have any medicine for you today. It hurts. I know, but there's nothing I can do right now. I'm sorry, honey. Hi. Sorry, I didn't mean to ignore you. It's just crazy around here right now. What brings you to the camp? Just doing what we all do. Working for credits. Today's job, medicine retrieval and delivery. Oh, the sleeping guard must have sent you. Yeah, I saw the guard sleeping at his post, and I took the medicine too. It's no use trying to cover it up. See, I took the supplies to help the refugees. More and more of them are dying every day. The Republic won't help. So when I saw the guard sleeping, I helped myself. But then the Separatists took the medicine from me. Now they have it, and we don't. So here's the deal. You agree to bring the supplies to me so I can give them to the refugees, and I'll tell you which way the Separatists went. Unless, of course, you'd rather the Separatists keep the medicine. What's the upside for me? If I could pay you to bring the medicine back, I wouldn't have stolen it in the first place. I'm tired of being bullied because I don't carry a gun. If the war doesn't drive people out of their homes, the soldiers come and extort money out of them. Sometimes, someone's driven out of here only to be robbed. Taxed, they call it, on the way here. But they won't suffer for lack of medicine. Not if I can help it. I'll bring you the medicine. Sorry for the guilt trip. But I hope you realize you're doing the right thing. Riso here, at least, will be grateful. The Separatists fled to Talaran Village. Please hurry. There are people here in critical condition. Hang tight. I'll be back soon. Good. I look forward to your arrival. Thank you.
You're certainly not a resident here, and you're no separatist. You must be that hotshot freighter Captain Vidu described over the holo. He failed to express how beautiful you are, though. Color me impressed. These poor, starving ladies and I are very grateful for the supplies you've brought. If I wasn't so exhausted, I'd throw you a party. I don't need a party. Just information. Vidu said you're seeking information on a particular Separatist named Skavak. The only place to find personnel data like that is at Manit Point. I used to... acquire quality goods at a discount on Manit Point. I discovered all manner of shortcuts through the island's warehouses. I kept detailed schematics of every maintenance passage and tunnel there. Unfortunately, I had to abandon those schematics when I fled Manit Point. You've got a brilliant plan, right? I always have a brilliant plan. That's why I'm still alive. My schematics are still in my former home. However, I short-circuited the building's door and sealed it shut when I left. The only way to reopen the door is by disrupting Manit Point's power relays. Once you gain entry, you'll find my schematics cleverly disguised as an extraordinarily tedious treatise on bird watching. Don't worry, I'll teach you the code I use to conceal my schematics. You won't die of boredom reading about rare waterfowl. Now pay attention and listen carefully, because you really don't want to hear this twice. And replace every mention of the Mantellian flutter plume with the number three. Did you get all that? That's the most sadistic way to hide information I've ever heard. Then you clearly haven't lived enough. Once you read my schematics, the way into the Separatist computer station will become clear. Unfortunately, that only solves half your problems. The Separatists encrypt all their files. You'll need special equipment to decipher their data. That's Vidu's area of expertise, not mine. I'll uh, take those supplies now, if you don't mind. These poor ladies could use some cheering up. It's disgusting how you take advantage of these women. What do you suppose the Separatists would do to them without me around? I'm doing them a favor, trust me. Be a sport and kill some Separatists on your way out of here. Goodbye, Captain. You came back. Do you have the medicine? That's every last medkit. Seems the Separatists didn't live long enough to make much use of them. This is going to make a huge difference. Really, it's nice to find someone with a good heart here on Ord Mantel. Thank you. I was starting to lose faith that there were any good people left. There are still lots of good people in the galaxy. Maybe. It just seems like there aren't very many on Ord Mantel, I guess. Thank you again. You're being naive. Things will go right back to the way they were. Now that we're getting this kind of attention from the core worlds, they're bound to clean house. The troops aren't here to fight government corruption. They're here to fight the Separatists, period. I don't think you're giving them enough credit. You're living in a dream world. You must be the freighter Captain Vidu's expecting. It's a pleasure to meet you in person. 
I'm Cyrena. It's a pleasure meeting you. Likewise. My father flew tramp freighters, but I never developed a taste for space travel myself. Too dangerous for me. I heard about what happened with Skavik. Can't say I'm surprised. I told Vidu not to trust that scoundrel. Vidu's putting on a brave face for me, but I can tell he's terrified. Is it bad? Should I be worried? In situations like this, always trust your gut. Good advice. Thank you, Captain. Sorry for keeping you from your appointment. Vidu's waiting in his office. I know he's eager to speak with you. We've got important business. I'm sure you do. Thank you for indulging me. Farewell, Captain. Back already, Captain. Uh, help me and Corso finish this robe of steak. Don't let this fine cut of meat go to waste. Boss, quit acting like it's your last meal. Rogan the Butcher isn't going to kill you. Good to see you again, Corso. Likewise. Looking forward to working together, Captain. Nice work, Intolerant. We're getting somewhere in this hunt for Skavik. Ricky told me he gave you a way into the Separatist hideout. Said something about a secret entrance? I always wondered how Ricky could steal so much from Manet Point and not get caught. Getting into Manet Point will be extra tricky. For one thing, you have to swim there. When the Separatists invaded, they blew up the only bridge leading onto the island. Turned it into their private resort. You'll be walking into the Rankers' den, Captain. Maybe I'll get lucky and find Skavik wandering around. I doubt he'll be that easy to find, and I don't recommend asking for him door to door. If you download the Separatist computer files onto this datapad and bring it back here, we'll handle the rest. I'd rather go with you, Captain. My Viroblade's pretty good for chopping Separatists off at the knees. I call it Huey. Forget about the Separatist, Corso. I want that slicer kit here before the Captain comes back. I'm on it, boss. Good luck at Man at Point, Captain. Last thing I need is Corso turning one-man army out there. Kid'll just get himself killed for nothing. Separatists wiped out his family a couple of years ago. Corso took it personal. I don't blame him for wanting revenge. Mixing personal grudges and business is like dropping a thermal detonator into a fuel dump. Vidu, there's someone named Rogan calling on the Holo. He sounds upset. Oh, that's all I need. Uh, stall him for me, sweetheart. Remember the plan. Disrupt Manet Point's power relays, get inside Reiki's old home, and use those schematics to enter the Separatist base. When you're in, slice into the Separatist computer and download everything onto my datapad. Good luck. Damn Separatists. All they're doing is cutting themselves off. Cockeyed fools. All of them. Did you hear about the bridge to Manet Point? Those foolish Separatists think that by blowing up the bridge to Manet Point, they're striking a blow for the people. But all they've created is division. And division is death. Lots of good people got stuck in Manet Point when the bridge went out. The Separatists are trying to divide us. Divide and conquer, right? There was a doctor there, Jay and Kett. Brilliant medical man and staunch Republic supporter. Essential to our effort. We need someone with the know-how to find him. Would you pay someone with the know-how? Dr. Kett is worth a lot to the Republic. Of course we'll pay. Like I said, last contact we had with the good doctor, he was on Manet Point. Seeing as the bridge is out, you'll have to swim the channel. And you'll want to watch out for the Separatists on the shore. If you have any luck finding the doctor, try to get him back here. Think you can handle it? One doctor coming right up. Great. That's the spirit. You know, I think we've got a chance at winning this thing. Now hurry up to Manet Point. We haven't a moment to lose. You're being naive. Reminder, mechanized travel is for official business only.
Listen, if you're here to tell me to clear out, then I'll tell you the same thing I told that uptight commander. Not going to happen. Got it? I've got as much right as you do to be here. In fact, I've got more. I'm a model of free speech. A paragon for posterity. What are you? A local grunt. That's what. No good to anybody. So don't go telling me to clear out. I won't do it, and that's that. You got all the manners of a pig lizard. That's not attitude. I'll show you attitude. You like that, don't you? Seeing spirited citizens stand up for themselves and... Oh, damn. You're not actually with the locals, are you? Sorry about that. My mouth always engages first. Brain's working now, though, and I got an idea. I need something done, and I don't have enough credits to bribe the whole corrupt Ord Mantel army. I've got enough to bribe a smaller army, though. You for hire? I could always use more credits. Fantastic. Good to see someone with the complete lack of scruples needed to protect justice and freedom in the Republic. My partner and I were in Manit Point recording stories of the uprising when the Separatists attacked. Bombs everywhere. Carnage like you wouldn't believe. Fabulous footage. My partner got lost. Good kid, but not a lot upstairs, you know. He's still out on that island somewhere. I'll find your partner. <laughs> sure. Why not? I mean, he was a nice kid. I'm more worried about the hollow recordings we took of the uprising, though. Look, if you can find my partner and bring him back, great. His name is Wax, and he's a self-important little hollow recording specialist. If he's dead or whatever, I'll still pay you for the holodiscs if you can find them. Great footage on there, fantastic, gory stuff. Goodbye, crazy woman. Bring me those discs. Looks like you're in a bind. Who took down your ride? Blasted seps. Look at my AT. Their rocket launchers tore through the Durasteel hide like it was nothing. From the look of the vapor trails, I'm thinking Mersan MX-2s. That's stolen Republic ordnance. They're using our own weapons against us. That could be trouble. The rockets were launched from the bridge. I need those rocket gunners taken out, and every cache of stolen weapons on Manit Point destroyed. Are you game? What's the upside for me? You'll be rewarded for your efforts, I promise you. Good luck over there. Oh, <laughs> 
Dr. Jan. Please! Just a minute, Dake. You're not with the Separatists, judging from the bloodbath. What are you doing here? What do you want? If you mean to harm these children, I won't let it happen. I'm the cavalry. Let's get you out of this mess. There are people on this island who need saving more than I do. The Republic shouldn't waste its time on one man. And besides, I can't leave the island. It's... it's the children. They need me. They're orphans, most of them. Their parents were killed during the fighting over Manat Point. A few of them have family on the other side, but they're too young to swim that far. They all need food and medicine. I won't leave them here. Republic troops are dying without your aid. These children will die without my aid. I am a doctor. If I don't help the innocent, who will? The Separatists focus blindly on their cause while food and supplies dwindle daily. The Republic won't help either. I've seen the corruption in their ranks. They don't care about the people of Manet Point. I'm sure the Republic would help if they knew. You have more faith than I have. But I'll cut you a deal. If you can convince the Republic to send help for these children, I'll return to Fort Garnick. I'll work every angle I can. I doubt the Republic's going to requisition boats just because you said so. Here, I'll write out what I need and sign it. At least they won't laugh at you then. And if you can get them to come and save these children, then I'll come back too. Consider me signed on. I'll believe it when I see it. I sure hope that cipher works.
Come on, Force, and say it just like I taught you. The Republic lackeys will drown in lakes of fire and blood, Master. Death to all who oppose the people's will, Master. Hey there. Uh, we had some trouble with the power relays. I need to check on the computer core. You mind? Master, I detect the presence of several non-functioning humans, specifically the bodies over there. Setting alert status red. By the stars! Republic troops have invaded our base! Oh no! Force and activate combat protocols. We gotta warn the others. Master, my sensors detect no evidence of hostile forces. But that doesn't make sense! When was the last time you calibrated that droid's sensors? Not recently enough to take any chances. We need to put the base on alert and rally the men. Here, comrade. If you see any Republic lackeys, use this on them. Let's go, Forsen. There's no time to waste.
Hey, watch out! You're getting in my light. The lighting is essential to selling the message of urgency, you know? Lamala sent me for the holodisks. The holodisks? No! You're from the Republic, aren't you? Come to kill me for my noble work. Well, you're not going to succeed. There's no way I'm giving up my footage of the glorious uprising. Lamala may be willing to hide the Republic's warmongering, but I'm not. I'm with the Separatists now. Do you still have the recordings? Of course I do. That's what it's all about. I've re-edited those hollows to show the plight of the Separatists and their families. So you go back to Lamala and tell her she can find another Patsy to do her work. I've seen the light. Give me those holodisks, or I'll make you give me those holodisks. What? I, I, don't, I don't even have a weapon. I'm just a journalist. Fine, okay, you can have the holodisks. There's just one little problem. The Separatist propaganda officers already have them. You want those discs, you best get them, before they distribute them so everyone can see. On quite the light show out there. I'm impressed. I'd say you've earned your pay today.
The hollow discs, you've got them. That is fantastic, amazing, unexpected even. I can't wait to see the footage from where the bodies were. Wait, where's Wax? Turns out, he joined the Separatists. Blast. And since he didn't come back with you, I'm guessing he didn't give up the holodiscs willingly. Now it'll take a miracle to convince him to come home. Stupid kid. Always sympathizing with the underdog a little too much. Anyway, fair's fair. Here are your credits. Spend them in good humor. It's been grand. Really. Right. It's footage like this that makes all the fighting and death worth it, you know? Mechanized travel is for official business only. What's this? Where's the doctor? Jan Kett refused to leave. What is this? The doctor needs... Has he gone insane? This is an awfully tall order. Judging by what he's written here, soft-hearted Jan has found every single orphan on that island to take care of. Figures. You saw the situation. What do you think? Can we really get the doctor and the kids out of there, or should we just focus on the doctor himself? Those children need help. Rescue them and the doctor. You're right. The vision is death. We'll get those kids. You better believe we'll get those kids. Good work finding the doctor. You can take your pay and go now. We'll handle it from here. Again, good work. It pays. That's enough for me. Huh. Right. Well, I have work to do. Children to save. Keep fighting the good fight. alone, Bracco. If Vito knew about this, he'd... Vito? That blob can't even protect himself. It's only a matter of time before Rogan the Butcher punches your fat meal ticket for good. You better start thinking about the future, girl. When Vito's gone, you'll need new friends. Captain! Thank goodness. I could use your help here. There's nothing wrong with you, scum. A good thrashing won't fix. You're cute, little girl. But not so cute we won't make an example out of you. Any last words? <laughs> Never mind. We don't care. You killed them all. For me. Thank you, Captain. I don't know what else to say. Don't make a big deal out of it. I hardly broke a sweat. They never stood a chance against you. Does anyone? What Bracco said was true. Rogue and the Butcher will kill Vito if those blasters don't turn up. I hope whatever course of action you're pursuing pays off, Captain. More lives than your own depend on it. Everything will be alright. Trust me. Hearing you say it makes me believe it. I'll be sure to keep out of harm's way from now on.
It left a big mess in my warehouse. Cyrena says it was Bracco's fault, but now I've got a serious morale problem. Send a cleanup crew to scrape Bracco off the floor and let's move on. My people have better things to do than scrub up fried morons. That stuff is bad for business. I hope you didn't come back from Manet Point empty-handed, Captain. You did good, Captain. Corsa found us a terrific little slicer kit, so we're ready to decrypt that data. We'll know where to find Skavik soon, but until then, I've got a special job that only you can do. Haven't I done enough for you already? What, you've got some pressing engagement? Our lives are on the line. I need you to keep Rogan the Butcher off our backs. Cyrena stalled him earlier, but it's not enough. We need to distract Rogan by giving him something he really wants. A canister of some special chemicals from a nearby village. The big boom run? Are you kidding, boss? I can see it making Rogan's day, but it's blasted risky. How will this big boom run make Rogan happy? It will make him a lot of money from the Republic and kill a lot of Separatists. It's a win-win scenario. There's a loopy scientist with a chemical that can supercharge artillery cannons and makes them do more damage. But it's less stable than a drunk Savrip on a speeder bike. Handle it wrong, and suddenly you're little chunks of ex-captain. Sure, it's tricky, but you've got the skill to get it here. Did I mention this run pays unbelievably well? Just how unbelievably well are we talking about? You do this, and you can buy some nice upgrades for your starship, when you finally get it back. Trimbo is the scientist's name. Got a place in Oradam Village. I'll let him know you're coming. See me before you make that run, Captain. We should talk. Captain, the big boom run isn't a stroll on the beach. You'll need an edge to make it back alive. This here is a Sora Sub SSK Heavy Blaster. It's cut for a quick draw and got a hair trigger. I call it Flashy. Flashy's the first blaster I ever owned. I want you to have it. Like I always say, never look a free blaster in the barrel. I'll breathe a lot easier knowing you're ready for anything. Mechanized travel is for official business only. Please, I'm, I, I'm at the end of my rope. Soldiers, soldiers beat me, took my belongings, my daughter. They were criminals, not good soldiers. Then help me. Don't turn uh, a blind eye, like, like the rest. Please help. My, my daughter means everything to me. Help me get my daughter back. Help. I don't understand why soldiers would take your daughter. Where would they take her? I-I don't know. There's-there's been... There's been a string of abductions lately. 
but I never thought they'd take her. I, n I, I never thought they'd take my... Coel. They... They were headed toward the fort. Please, please find my daughter. I'll see this through. I promise. Please. Hurry. I, I, I want to see my daughter again. You must be here for my husband. I told Master Vidu he's gone out fishing. Would you like a sweet flat cake instead? It's fresh. This whole place is crawling with separatists. What's Trimbo doing out fishing? Catching dinner, I hope. We're making Aqualish medley. If you don't feel like waiting for Trimbo, the walk out to him is lovely. The beach is so relaxing. Trimbo's at his fishing camp. He'll be thrilled to have some company. And now, excuse me, dearie. These rhodian peppers won't cook themselves. Report your ailments. You are fit for duty. Return to your post. Don't stand there. That spot is reserved exclusively for my Gundark friends. You're clearly not a Gundark. Your ears are too small. Listen, do you smell that? There's a pot of Alderanian stew bubbling. But how could I smell it all the way on Ord Mantel? Vidu sent me to pick up a canister of chemicals from you. What's a Vidu? Some kind of musical instrument? Is, is, is that what keeps playing that awful tune I can't get out of my head? Hmm, I do recall a man saying to expect a stranger coming for my chemicals. You seem pretty strange. Was he talking about you? You've inhaled a lot of chemicals, haven't you? Did my wife tell you that? She's been dead 20 years now. Don't listen to her. People haven't had much luck getting my chemicals. Know why? Those Ugnot assassins in the woods attack everyone who visits me. Ugnot assassins? Don't you mean separatists? Who do you really think controls the separatists? Those crafty little swine, that's who. But we can beat them. What you really need is a precision teleporter, but a former assistant crashed my prototype into the sun. Good luck, my friend. If you should explode, please feel free to come back and tell me all about it. Everyone else has. Mechanized travel is for official business only.
easy does it. I've got a storage unit here to stabilize the canister so it doesn't blow. There we go. I think I'll just stand way over here. It's completely stable now. I can't wait to let Rogan know the good news. Getting Trimbo's chemicals saved our necks, Captain. Rogan will be too busy selling them to think about the blasters. The Trimbo guy was a few freighters short of a convoy. I know what you mean. Every time I talk to him, he thinks I'm his great-grandfather who crashed into a black hole. I've got good news and great news, Captain. We cracked the Separatist computer files and found Skavik. Vidu, you promised you wouldn't get so excited. It isn't good for your heart. Sorry, sweetheart. But this is going to be great! Skavik won't even see us coming! Ha! Enough standing around. Let's haul jets. Easy there, Captain. We've got some details to sort out first. Skavik is taking the blasters to the Separatist base. Those wackos built their headquarters inside an old volcano. Crazy, huh? What do you expect from foaming at the mouth murderers? I wish that volcano would blow its top. Skavik's delivering the blasters to a psycho named Darig at the base. You need to get there first. When Skavik shows up, you can ambush him, grab your ship, and fly back here. Easy, huh? I won't be happy until Skavik and all his Separatist friends are dead. That makes two of us. Take Corso with you, Captain. The kid knows more about blasters and vibroblades than anybody I've ever met. I owe Skavik payback for taking Torchy. That was lower than low. It'll be nice to have some backup out there. <laughs> Glad you think so. Then it's a deal. You two head for the Separatist base, kill Darig, and ambush Skavik when he shows up. I've got a bottle of Chandralin brandy to open when you get back. I'm just looking forward to getting back into space. I'd wish you two good luck, but I don't want to jinx anything. Just come back in one piece. Let's keep this quick and quiet, shall we? I'm Milo Phipps, Strategic Information Service, former senator, one-time governor of Dantooine. You do confidential work, don't you? You've probably heard about the Separatist base up in the volcano. Well, the Republic needs someone to do some work there, confidentially. Make me an offer? And I'll think about it. Oh, you'll be well compensated. Have no doubts about that. Like I said, I represent the Republic here on Ord Mantell, and an item has come up that I think you can help us with. But it will require you to break into the Separatist base and take out their toughest guards. If I'm going to take all the risks, the pay better be good. It will be. You think the Republic's stingy? Let me stress that this is a very sensitive matter. The Republic promised protection to a pirate a few months back, a pirate with whom we share common enemies. Recently, those enemies, the Separatists, captured that pirate and are holding him at their base. We need someone to free him. Why does the Republic want to free a pirate? I know, I know better to lock them up and throw away the key, right? Wrong. This pirate knows enough to end this war, at least on Ord Mantell. This pirate approached us with information on the Separatists and their operations in exchange for protection from the same. His relationship with them went sour, see? But the Separatists got to him before we did. The Republic promised protection. I'm asking you to keep that promise by breaking him out. Can you do it? It's tempting, but pirates tend to cut into my profits. Well, I hope you will decide in our favor. It will be a great service to the Republic, and, I might add, the reward is quite handsome. Go speak to my man at the entrance to the fort, Lieutenant Bendik. He'll fill you in on the details. If it weren't for Fort Garnick, we'd all be speaking Separatists right now. This is the last home of freedom on Lord Mantell. Ah, oh, great. So that blasted bureaucrat Milo finally found someone naive enough to want to free that damn pirate Veeam set. This is just business. Got it? Seems everyone on Ord Mantell has a price. 
Vincet is filth. Bloodthirsty, ruthless filth. And he's a war criminal. His ships have been screwing up Republic supply routes for years. Countless people have died because of him. He took out my brother's battle cruiser. Killed thousands more. The Republic should be planting his head on a stake, not offering him protection. You don't get to make that call. If you free this bloodthirsty pirate, what's to stop anyone from thinking they can attack Republic ships and just beg for mercy later? The Republic knows this is a difficult mission. They won't be surprised if there's a little slip, little accident. And since, you know, I'm in charge of payroll here, I could throw in a nice, healthy sum to sweeten the deal if you, say, accidentally killed this pirate. So you're gonna kill him or what? This galaxy could use one less pirate. You're damn right. And the Republic could use one less enemy. The pirate's being kept in the holding cell in the Separatist's base. You'll have to figure out the rest. I get the feeling you'll know what to do when you get there. Good luck. Freelancer, I hear you've been mucking up the Separatist plans. Don't know what your investment in this war is, but we need all the help we can get. This Separatist business on Ord Mantell has gone on long enough, don't you think? You can't walk two paces on this planet without getting shot at! Can't say I'd recommend anyone doing business here, no matter how tough. My boys could use some support out at the Sep Stronghold, trying to secure the landing area so we can bring more troops in. But resistance is heavy and they're taking a beating. You're not under my command, but I'd appreciate if you report to Sergeant Vandal and lend a hand. What's the upside for me? Republic doesn't ask a civilian to put himself in danger without reward. Help us, and you'll be compensated. Like I said, Sergeant Vandal's running the mission. I'll let the beach camp know you're coming. Get in here on the double. We don't have all day. I already told you. I don't know anything. I swear. Sure, that's what you said last time we talked. But now I'm thinking maybe you just didn't have enough incentive to tell the truth. Hey, what are you doing here? You're not allowed in here. This is a top secret operation. Top secret, eh? Illegal, more like. You should talk, scum, considering the sort of things your kind does. We serve the Republic. He's lying! They've kidnapped us! They're torturing us! Shut up! Ugh! Please, you have to stop them! They're torturing us! I said shut up! She's a traitor to the Republic, she deserves what she gets! But the courts are full, you see, and so justice needs a little help. If that means Republic soldiers have to twist a few arms, so be it. You're mixed up in some bad business. Torture's a legitimate tool of warfare. Do you think the Separatists won't use it? Do you think the Empire won't use it? These wretches have been caught, every last one of them, doing work for the Separatists. They are traitors. And more importantly, they have information on Separatist movements. All we're doing is coaxing it out of them. Information that will save so many Republican Mantellian lives. Who'll care how we got it? I'll care. And I'll make sure your superior cares, too. Look, we don't like having to do this, but what are our choices? Listen, you take this ring back to this girl's daddy and tell him it's all you could find of his little girl. The ring's got a listening device in it. We'll be able to gather all the evidence we need without resorting to these unsavory means. Got it? This charade of justice ends now. Whoa, whoa, take it easy. The last thing we need in here is a shootout, all right? What the little traitor's so bad, fine, take her. But the only people you're helping are the Separatists. Thank you. Thank you for freeing me. It... it was terrible. Are you really with the Separatists? No. No, we went to a couple of protests, attended a few meetings, but we never did anything. 
We certainly don't know anything. Yeah, sure. It's the truth! We had no idea speaking our minds would get us marked as traitors. Doesn't get much worse than that. I'm glad you see things my way. But thank you. I'd be dead without you. travel is for official business only. get today. Day isn't over yet. I'll win that prize from Gizmel. Wait and see. Prizes for bagging the most saps, not the most excuses. Thank you. Thank you. You saved my daughter. Everyone, this is the good person who saved my daughter. She called to tell me what you've done and how grateful she is. I, I, I can't thank you enough. You don't happen to have any kind of reward for me, do you? Yes. Now that my daughter's coming back to me, thank you so much. Captain Zuss sends you? Huh. I was expecting someone a little more official. Hope that blaster's not just for show. We got the Sep stronghold in our sights. Orders are to secure a landing pad and establish a secondary insertion point for the assault. I need you to shut down the security fields around the landing pad, and then disable the defense guns so our troop shuttles can land. Can you handle it? Just step back and let me take care of it. It's your mission. I'll radio the shuttle so they're ready to move in the second you get the landing pad clear. Report back to the captain when you're done.
money to build something like this.
ti pona pona manci kabok non ni slemo. I'm beginning to think it might not be such a bad idea to kill you. Oh, wama wanka mi tuske o wana tablota wi jawa. Karibo uto chuba krata wan. I'm gonna kill you more than I have ever wanted to kill anyone. Oh, wama wanka mi tuske o wana tablota wi jawa. Itzuk nanki he chalangtong ima chechu. You die right here and right now. Ituna.
this game from. criminal vermin. How dare you invade my fortress and murder my courageous brothers in arms! Your pal Skavik stole my freighter. I want it back. There's no ship here for you. Only death. You are guilty of crimes against the oppressed people of Ord Mantell. The sentence is death. Memorize our faces well, you criminal filth, for we are your righteous executioners. Do you have any last words, degenerate swine? I love killing morons like you. Let justice be served! I surrender! I surrender! Please! I don't want to die! I know why you're here, and you're wasting your time! I'm here for Skavik and my starship. Where are they? Skavik is long gone. He left here hours ago. Tirig was stupid to fight you. He got everyone killed, when he should have just told you the truth. Skavik showed up a few hours ago to deliver the guns, but it was all a trick. He pretended to be on our side so he could steal some rusty antique droid from Derek. Skavik came here to steal a droid? Some worthless pile of scrap that had been in Derek's family for generations. That droid was ancient. It's practically useless. But Skavik grabbed it like some big treasure and blasted his way out. He left in your ship. I don't know where he went, but I can guess who does. Skavik has a girl at Fort Garnick named Sirena. You're telling me Sirena's with Skavik? They go way back from what I've heard. They've been scamming Vidu all along. It was Sirena who warned us you were coming. If you want to find out where Skavik went, Sirena's the one who knows. Please, let me go! I have a family back on the mainland. Please! Separatist scum killed my family, and I promised myself I'd bury every last one of you. I... I've only been here a few months! I didn't kill anyone's family! I only ever followed orders! Then I order you to die. Belay that order, Corzo. Captain, I need to do this. I can't just let him go home and pretend like nothing ever happened. 
He could be useful if he switches sides. Please, I swear to you I'll never serve a man like Derek again. I'll just go home and take care of my family. Get out of here before I change my mind. Thank you. Come on, Captain. We need to have a little heart-to-heart -heart with Sirena. Greetings. You are cleared for the following travel routes. Be safe out there. I heard our pirate friend had a little accident trying to escape the Separatists' base. Our pal Phipps' face turned purple when he heard the news. Brilliant. Brilliant work there. As soon as I met the guy, I said to myself, this can only end one way. Well, I'm glad it did. Here's your reward. Consider it fair compensation for your service to the Republic. And remember, this is our little secret. Word is, you secured the landing area. Good work. War's never pretty, but I want you to know you're a real hero. It's important to remember we're fighting for peace on Ord Mantell. And credits. Don't forget credits. You earned them. Thank you for your efforts. Hopefully this fight's almost done. I can't believe you fried Vito, sweetheart. So what if he caught you talking to Separatists? He threatened to turn me into Rogan the Butcher. I had to kill him. Besides, now we can finally be together. Yeah. And the thing is, my cargo hold is full and yeah, I'm busy with work. I'll call you sometime, though. I promise. What are you talking about? You promised to get me out of here. I've done everything for you, Skavik. You did it for the money. Same as me. The only difference is... You're not actually getting paid. I'll see you around, darling. <laughs> Captain, I... I didn't see you come in. It's wonderful you're still alive. How long have you been back? Lady, I'm gonna enjoy watching you die. I guess you heard all that, huh? Look, I know things that can help you. Skavik used me just like he did everyone else. That man could charm the armor off a Mandalorian. Rogan the Butcher's bounty hunters are on their way right now. We don't want to be here when they arrive. 
Skavik took your ship and the guns to Coruscant. If you go now, he won't know you're coming for him. I still have plenty of time to kill you before I go. Every second you waste threatening me lets Rogan's bounty hunters get closer. Am I really worth it? The Separatists are retreating from this island, thanks to you. And the Republic just reopened the shuttle port. I'll give you a shuttle pass to Coruscant if you let me disappear. Do we have a deal? I'll take that shuttle pass off your corpse. You ladies sure can be vicious. Hope you don't ever expect me to shoot a woman. If a woman was shooting at you, you wouldn't shoot back? Self-defense is one thing. You backed Sirena into a corner. You probably think I'm some dumb farm boy, huh? Head full of old-fashioned ideas? I don't think you're dumb. You're actually kind of sweet. Oh. Well, <laughs> thanks, Captain. I like you, too. Poor old Vito. I wish he could hear what we did. Would have put a smile on his face. It's not healthy for us to stick around, Captain. I believe what Sirena said about bounty hunters coming. We don't know how long Skavik will stay on Coruscant either. Let's hop a shuttle and catch him while we can. I'm not one for causes, but, uh, I'm on board for that one. Vito left me some stuff. I expect he'd want me to share it with you. Let's head for the shuttle board. We'll be off this planet before you know it. Anguas nimni mata sunri fo papo cha wila pi. I'm sick of being cooped up on starships, Zoru. I want to run around and shoot things for a while. Biz gamayo kojedwanti. Noa huyat ya chavopa. I'll be sure to call Rogan sometime. Tell him I said hello. Chut chut. Pochakula cha no gando do waletapa. Biz gamayo kojedwanti. Noa huyat ya chavopa. You guys want a thief named Skavik, not me. Yatuka poka fu krida. Vota mo krita chai chai. Oto nu avati kona ituta od miskapunda. Sorry, I only travel first class. Joto pa. Slimo gusha skroni. Jo ping wampa lahagwa. Jekoska umpasa dobiska. But I'm glad you didn't.